Welcome to Video Games Awesome Live! This is Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney, Trials and Tribulation, Trial 2. Ooh. Uh, it took us two full shows to get through. That's the first time that's ever happened for a first trial in one of these games so far. Really? Um, that first trial was a doozy, and it alluded to some dark and nefarious, what else, but dark history in the Phoenix Wright uh, saga. Um, Everything that looks so peachy and cute on the surface in this game always has something it's really evil. seedy under under the the. What about Maya? Skin. Everything with Ma Maya. Oh. Maya's the best. Maya gets kidnapped. Yeah. Maya. I'm talking about. I'm not saying that they're bad people. I'm, oh, I'm saying okay. that like everything looks all happy and people. stuff. Da 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 da. Oh, she got kidnapped by a fucking assassin who's starving her to death. Um, she didn't get the burgers. So the the first uh, trial was sort of sorry. Um, the first trial was like a uh, a a flash to the a blast from the past. Um, kind of a, looking at Phoenix's first time in the courtroom, but he wasn't a lawyer. He was being defended by a Mia Fey, and it kind of um, talked about two cases, but we only really learned about one in mm -hmm. which was the one at hand. But it, it alluded to this other case that kind of kicked off a whole thing. And I think Phoenix even said it inspired him to become... No, he was inspired to become a lawyer because of something that happened in grade school. Do you think but, we'll but, hear more about that? Oh, definitely. Yeah? Definitely. And we haven't seen the last of Little Miss Fuckface Mick Redhead. Yes. Here we go. Um, Dolly. Yeah, Dahlia. So we've already looked at uh, um, the intro. Let's watch it again. Okay. The Stolen Turnabout. Detective, we made it. Woo, what do we leave? Glad the jewel is still safe. Hehehe. <laughs> ho ho, you said it, pal. It must have been our rock solid security and this scared the burglar off. Would you mind opening the safe just a quack? I'm sure it's fine. Did you memorize that code? It'll probably be the clue that we need later. No. Nope. <laughs> it ended in a three, I think. And a calling card from Mask to Mask. I still don't know what... Oh, front guards, turn on the searchlights! <laughs> Better luck next time, gentlemen! That's what I feel like, because of his over-the-top laughter. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me, but I'm afraid I must... Batman! We shall meet again when the next moon is full! <laughs> <laughs> Man, the music in that is awesome. Yeah, that's fun. And the return of Maya. Yes. Nick, get a lot of these. All right. Hey, are you listening to me? Can you clean the toilet later? This is important. Oh, you can clean the <laughs> toilet later. This is important. Uh, what are you freaking about now? He <laughs> he. Today will be the last time you talk to me that way. Huh? We are about to hit the big time. Big time? And what do you mean by we? You don't mean you and me are. Don't be silly. What did he mean? And what did you just say? Uh, you and me are. And then she said one last thing before it disappeared. Oh, yeah. They're doing that a lot in this game and it's really pissing little let's players like me off. Aww. I can't keep up. Oh, flash, flash. <clears throat> I am talking about me and Barely, of course. Hello, it's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> it's a pleasure to see you again, Mr. Nick. You haven't changed a bit. Wait, what are you doing here anyway? Hee <laughs> hee. Haven't you heard, Mr. Nick? Here, take a look at this. What's this? Some kind of poster? 
Treasure exhibition. Hey, that's the pot I that know early that broke. that pot. Kirin Village. Isn't that... That's right. It's our hometown. Barely in mind that these... What's this about treasures from the boonies? Ha ha ha, very funny. You can laugh all you want. But you'll be singing another tune tonight. Tonight? What about tonight? The Treasures of Karain exhibit doesn't actually start until next week, but... The promoter sent us some special VIP entry passes! That's why I dressed up extra special today! What do you think, Vic? She's just wearing a thong. <laughs> <laughs> Same Maya, different day. <laughs> <laughs> This young lady here is Maya Faye. The younger sister of Mia Faye, my friend and mentor. I first, I first met her two years ago. I was working on the case surrounding Mia's death, and ever since then... How's her leg still up? That kind of class just proved pervades all the way through into the afterlife. Damn. She's got style. Whew. And Gam's from here to Yaya. Testify. I've been the one who's been keeping this law office afloat from behind the scenes. <laughs> Is she jumping in to Phoenix's yeah, like, flashback. head? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's just a cover for her true identity. In reality, she's a spirit medium and a bit of a shady character <laughs> <laughs> with an obsession with ladders. Who are you calling Shiggy? And this little girl is Pearl Faye, but I usually just call her Pearls. She's my <laughs> face. Uh. She's Maya's cousin and a spirit medium in training herself. I know I'm a bit young, but I want to help in any way I can, Mr. Nick. Don't you girls need school? Yeah, man. Kurain Village is the home of the mysterious Kurain channeling technique. And Maya here is the daughter of the Kurain School of Channeling's... Kurain School of Channeling's master. Okay. Did, did we decide on how to call this school? It's Kurain? Kurain? I think it's Kurain. Kurain. Okay. I think that makes sense. I don't know. It sounds ridiculous, but it's no joke. I've seen her power with my own eyes. <laughs> it's the real thing, all right. Mm -hmm. How long are you going to make two gorgeous women like us wait? Yes, Mr. Nick. I can't wait any longer. I want to see the exhibit. Looks like I don't get a choice here. Might as well head on out. Treasure exhibit poster added to the court record. <laughs> October 11th. Is this the same day? Same day. Thank you. Uh, it just said 1 p.m. I think at the very beginning. But whenever it came to our office, it said October 11th, 3.20 something. Oh, okay. So I think we don't actually know. It's this probably is. a really important clue. I know. How did I miss that? Pardon me while I just arrange some things here. All right. Lordly Taylor, the city's fanciest and most expensive department store. Treasure exhibit, huh? I have to admit, I'm pretty impressed. Ooh! Is that the fucking divider? Yeah! <laughs> Gah! 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 It's okay. It's fun watching that back fast forward on the video yeah watching my he head go like red like really fast <laughs> wow this is awesome yeah you can make even the cheapest junk look great <laughs> it all depends on how you display it oh they even have the dusty old hanging scroll that was in Faye manor storeroom 
Oh, yeah. I remember scribbling on it when I was a little girl. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> on a family heirloom. Same week. The person in charge of this exhibit is waiting for us in the basement warehouse. All right. I guess we should go down and say hello. Who is it? Let's examine some. Ugh. It's okay. Ugh. It's okay. I think I remember this old folding screen here. I'm pretty sure it was an important piece of evidence in that murder case that happened in Kirain Village. This folding screen is the greatest of all the spirit channeling secrets. The Six Leaf Kirain Sacred Writing Folding Screen! <laughs> if it's so secret, why is it the most prominent thing in this exhibit? Oh, Mystic Maya, look! I can't believe it! Ah, it's so cute! It's a little diorama of Curing Village! Yeah, look at that! But somehow, it seems to reek of dreariness! Oh, but somehow, it seems to reek of dreariness! Oh, Mystic Maya! It's your house! It even says Fey Manor on it! Yikes! You're right! I kinda want to add the famous in front of it! <laughs> Don't do it, Maya. They might get mad. They're just a bunch of old urns. And are these really treasures too? Of course they are! This is a treasure exhibit, isn't it? Well, yeah, I guess so. So all it takes to be a treasure is age? No wonder nobody likes museums. <laughs> I love Phoenix. Museums rock! <laughs> I like them too, I just love saying things like that too. <laughs> What's with this big cushion? It's just lying with nothing on it. Uh oh. Oh no. Uh oh. Hmm, well it must be for the greatest treasure of all. Greatest treasure? Is there something like that? Ha! Huh? Why of course there is! Right, Barry? Oh! Um yeah, of course. Yeah, I'll bet it would really take your breath away! A piece of cloth with a ton of finely written characters jammed onto it. Probably historic knowledge only mediums would know. Hmm, let's see. Here's the title in English. 108 Ways to Save Money. I'm pretty sure the number has gone up since the last time I saw it. <laughs> well, we're always looking for new ways, you know. Being a medium sounds like a rough way of life. How many was it before? I don't remember. Uh, they might. These fuckers might. These, these, these lovely fucking people? bastards might. The, these wonderful people in the chat? Yeah. Yeah. That's what you meant to say. Yeah. Alright, I guess we're gonna move on to the basement. There's like 100 or 101 or something. <laughs> there we go. Basement warehouse. Hey, this looks just like the um, parking yeah, garage. Yeah, it sure does. From the murder of God, I don't even know who was murdered during that trial. Um, holy shit! This is the thing. You would think that Phoenix Red games would be horrible for replayability because once you know who done it, you know who done it. But they throw so much information at you that you're never going to be able to remember what actually happened during a trial. Bruce Goodman? Oh, yeah. Bruce Goodman. And they carried his corpse over from the police department. Right. Land uh oh Capo The popos are coming. On cue. You said police department. Ambiance. <laughs> <clears throat> October 11th. Lordly Taylor Basement Warehouse. Please donate to the Turbo Club so that we can buy that ranch we want. <laughs> Away from any noise. Yep, this is a basement warehouse, all right. This place is scary. I feel like a monster could jump out at any time. <laughs> Don't be scared, Belly. I will put a job. Oh, Mr. Wright. Eek! A monster, you are right! <laughs> huh? A monster? <gasps> oh, that's you! Speak of the devil. Good evening. Uh, what was hers? It was like... Good evening. It's good mm. to see you again. Good evening. It's good to see you again. You! I, I know you! 
<laughs> nice to see you again too, little miss. No, no. Remember, she has two different. Vo she she has that like uh, voice that like is a stone wall when she's trying to protect her emotions. But then, at the end of the trial, she showed her true colors that she can be cheerful. And then she her voice changed. To what? It was kind of like just uh, cheerful and higher up. Because she also had a voice that was meek when she got really scared. And she's like, mm. no, please. Oh, yeah, right. And then there was a cheerful voice. It was just How like. How do you remember? Oh. It was like, just do a happy voice. Haha, <laughs> 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 nice to see you again, too, little miss. Is it? Yeah, sure. <laughs> ah, <laughs> hello. <laughs> Is she a friend of yours, Nick? And how do you know her, Perry? Nice to meet you, too. I'm Adrian Andrews. I'm in charge of the promotion and planning of this treasure exhibit. Still planning it up with her old duotang. <laughs> I'm also responsible for the security arrangements. Oh, um, nice to meet you. Adrian sure has changed since we last met. So, this is the warehouse. The really valuable exhibit items are still stored away in here. Hmm. All right, when we come back, we're going to explore the warehouse, talk to Adrian Andrews, find out what's going on. I don't I'm not sure anything is going on yet. Like they're not here under the pretense of crime. No. This is just we're just hanging out. Yeah. All right. We'll be back after this with more Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trials and Tribulations on Video Games Awesome Live.